Hi guys, just a quick um, Bible prophecy in news update, birth pains. Here you see the La Palma, uh, the Canary Islands, volcanic islands, and we've had an earthquake tremor um, just off one of the islands, measuring 3.9, um, and it's happened at uh, 5.38am this morning, and the epicenter was at a depth of 36 kilometers and this is the canary islands uh la palma which is northwest africa and this in uh, bible prophecy is Trumpet number two, which is found in Revelation 8, and the second angel sounded, and as it were, a great mountain burning with fire was cast into the sea, and a third part of the sea became blood, and a third part of the creatures which are in the sea and had life died. And a third part of the ships were destroyed. So let's have a look at this. Um, La Palma obviously being a mountain <coughs> of fire. Meaning when the volcano erupts fire or lava is spewing out the like lava is spewing out the top. So it actually looks like a burning mountain of fire. Um, but what's unique about La Palma is it's cracked all the way along. S even the scientists say the next big eruption that happens at La Palma will send half of it crashing, or maybe all of it crashing into the sea. And when it does, here you see La Palma on the northwest coast. It'll send a mega tsunami all the way across the Atlantic, affecting... Or well, the northwest coast of Africa, the west coast of Portugal, Spain, and all the northwest coasts and westerly coasts of Ireland, England, Wales. Um, but the biggest affected would be New the east coast of America, all of America, the Caribbean islands, New York City. Um, and you remember that film, The Day After Tomorrow, when that mega tsunami comes in? Well... That is created by, you don't see it in the movie because they only give you a taste of the things. But the actual event was trumpet, is, is going to be trumpet number two where the volcano erupts and collapses into the sea, generating a mega wave, a mega tsunami, which comes in and just wipes out all the east coast. To the people in, you know, America... I would seriously suggest that they push back um, all the East Coast really is so flat that I, I see the only major um, safe point would be getting into these Appalachian Mountains all along the coast there there's Appalachian Mountains Appalachian Mountains but the rest of it is all flat so for anyone to survive this mega tsunami, and they will su survive it because we know from reading the Bible that um, <clears throat> that there's 144,000 saints who survive and who live through the trumpet judgments. Um, so we know that they will survive trumpet number two because they are seen in trumpet number five. When the locusts come out of the bottomless pit, the smoke of the bottomless pit. So, people have, this time people have noticed that the earthquakes at La Palma cause a threat. It's even been writ up, written up by a few uh, news channels. Uh, I mean, the Daily Star, the Daily Express, they all get a bit of a hype thing anyway. And kind of don't really know what they're really talking about. But it's good to see the exp 
exposure by media happening because I've been sharing these things for quite a while and uh, no one really pays attention to the signs or the birth pains of these things taking place but at end of the age Bible prophecy we like to deliver the truth in all things like what is the true uh, earthquake measure at, the, at this moment in time which is medium to low and it's not really increasing and the same thing with La Palma you get a lot of hype thing about it now this is an up-to-date um, data gra uh, graph on the activity of earthquakes at La Palma uh, this records that I've been keeping since March 2015 until present day this is the 3.9 earthquake that just hit yesterday well today <coughs> which has been added to it so as you can see from this graph that we went through a time of real high activity on the 31st of the, at the end of October 2015 we had a period of time that lasted a good two months so from the end of October until the end of December we had this great activity period here for La Palma so remember we have had times of greater activity but uh, the reality is that you know we have just had recent activity at La Palma so we shouldn't ignore these and say they happen all the time but we also need to keep record our own records like I do so we can see when when um, you know when was the highest activity as you can see here loads of earthquakes here a little bit more earthquakes as well this was a high period around March April time of 2017 <clears throat> and here we are now so I've inputted that record into the data I keep 3.1 uh, 3.9 earthquake so I've been past the Justin Roberts from end of the age Bible prophecy God bless you all Amen <laughs>